Hello, I'm Ruth Todd. Welcome to Hello Word Power. Today, we're learning words in English that begin with the letter D. Capital D, small d. The letter D makes this sound. D, D. Are you ready to begin? Let's start. Dab, dab, dab. You try it, dab. Yes, say it again, dab. One more time, dab. That's right, dab. Dab means to touch a surface gently with something soft. Jana always must dab her eyes with a handkerchief. Dab also means to apply or put on. Jeff will dab some ointment on the wound. A dab can also mean a little bit or small amount. Amy put a dab of mustard on her hot dog. Say it one more time, dab. That's right. Dabble, dabble. You say it, dabble. Again, dabble. That's right, dabble. Dabble means to do something not very seriously or not very thoroughly. Caroline dabbled in painting. She just tried it every once in a while. Say it again, dabble. Correct. Dad, dad, dad. You say it, dad. Again, dad. Correct. Dad is an informal word that means father. The children played in the park with their dad. The family waited for their dad to come home at the end of the day. Say it again, dad. That's right. Daffodil, daffodil, daffodil. You try it, daffodil. Again, daffodil. One more time, daffodil. That's right. A daffodil is a beautiful plant that has yellow, bell-like flowers and long, narrow green leaves. Daffodils bloom in the spring. Say it again, daffodil. That's right. Daily, daily, daily. You say it, daily. Again, daily. One more time, daily. That's right. Daily means something that is produced or something that happens every single day. I read the daily newspaper. I visit with my mother daily. Say it again, daily. That's right. Dainty, dainty, dainty. You try it, dainty. Again, dainty. One more time, dainty. That's right. Dainty means something small or delicate. The tablecloth had a dainty design on the edges. Dainty, say it one last time, dainty. Well done. Dairy, dairy, dairy. You say it, dairy. Again, dairy. That's right. Dairy has two meanings. A dairy is a place. It's where milk is bottled and milk products, such as cheese and yogurt, are made. All of these cows belong to the dairy. Dairy is the word that's also used for products made with milk, such as cheese, cream, and yogurt. Cheddar cheese is our favorite dairy product. Dairy, say it again. That's right. Daisy, daisy, daisy. You say it, daisy. Mm -hmm. Again, daisy. That's right. A daisy is a flower with white, pink, or yellow petals and a yellow center. Daisies bloom in this field. My favorite flower is a daisy. Say it again, daisy. Right. 
Dam. 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 You try it. Again, dam. That's right. A dam is a strong barrier that's built across a stream or a river to hold back water. The large dam created a beautiful lake. Dam. We'll be right back after a short break with more Hello Word Power. Are you looking for a way to change your life? The answer may be as easy as watching TV. Introducing Hello Channel, an exciting new channel that's designed to teach you to speak English. New opportunities will be available to you when you learn the language of the internet, commerce, travel, and diplomacy. No need to pay for your expensive schools or tutors. You can learn English by watching Hello Channel. Invest in yourself. For a brighter future, say hello. Welcome back to Hello Word Power. Are you ready to learn more words in English? Let's begin. Damage. 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 You try it. Damage. Yes, again, damage. One more time. Damage. Correct. Damage means to harm something. The fire will do great damage to the museum. If you drop your shoes on the table, you might damage its surface. Damage is also the harm that something does. The flood damage was extensive. Damage. Say it again. Damage. Correct. Damp. 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 You try it. Damp. Again. Damp. One more time. Damp. That's right. Damp means something moist or slightly wet. The nurse used a damp cloth to wipe the patient's forehead. Damp. Say it again. Damp. That's right. Dance. 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 You try it. Dance. Yes, again. Dance. One more time. Dance. Good job. Dance has several meanings. Dance means to move in time to music or rhythm. The girls and boys will dance at the party. A dance is also an event or a place where people go to dance. The couple went to the formal dance. The high school dance is the prom. A dance is also a particular set of steps. Their favorite dance is the waltz. My favorite dance is the tango. Dance. Say it one more time. Dance. Yes, well done. Danger. 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 You say it. Danger. Yes, again. Danger. That's right. Danger is a situation that is not safe. Avalanches are a great danger to skiers. Danger. Again, danger. That's right. Dare. 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 You say it. Dare. Again, dare. Right. Dare has two meanings. Dare means to challenge someone to do something. My sister likes to dare me to climb the steepest mountain. Dare also means to be brave enough to do something hard. Do you dare to jump off the high dive at the swimming pool? I will if you dare. Dare. Say it again. Dare. Correct. Dark. 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 You try it. Dark. Again, dark. That's right. Dark has several meanings. 
Dark means to be without any light. The night was dark. There was no moon. Dark also means that a color has more black in it than white. The businessman's suit was a dark blue. Dark can also mean bad or dismal. Molly was keeping a dark secret. She worried every day. Dark. Say it again. Dark. That's right. Dart. 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 You try it. Dart. Again, dart. That's right. Dart has two meanings. A dart is a pointed object that you throw at a target in the game called darts. It is popular to play darts at the pub. Dart also means to move quickly or suddenly. Be careful, your cat might dart into traffic and that would be dangerous. The child might dart into the parking lot. Watch carefully. Dart. Again, dart. We'll be right back after a short break with more Hello Word Power. Learning a new language can be difficult and discouraging, but it doesn't have to be. Hello, I'm Karen. Introducing Hello Channel, the revolutionary new channel designed especially to teach English. If you can speak English, the future is open for you, since speaking English means greater opportunity and higher paying jobs. By watching Hello Channel, you are immersed in this valuable language. You'll hear the words being spoken, You'll see the speakers' mouths when they say the words. You'll read what's being spoken in large, clear subtitles. And you'll speak out loud, practicing what you have just learned. There is no better or faster way to learn a language than total immersion. Hello Channel does exactly that. There's programming on every level so you can watch the shows that are just perfect for you. Whether you've spoken a little English, a great deal of English, or none at all, the Hello Channel has something for everyone. Join us for a convenient, affordable, and fun way to shape your future. There's so much in store for you if you'll just say hello. Welcome back to Hello Word Power. Are you ready to learn more words in English? Let's begin. Dash. Da sh. Dash. You say it. Dash. Yes, again, dash. Mm -hmm. A dash is a very small amount of something. The recipe called for a dash of salt. Dash. Dash also means to move very quickly. I must dash to answer the telephone. Dash. Again, dash. Data. 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 You say it. Yes, again, data. One more time. Data. Right. Data is information or facts. The scientist examined all of the data before coming up with a theory. Check the data before you call. Data. Date. 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 You say it. Date. Again, date. That's correct. Date has several meanings. A date is a particular day, month, or year. Mitchell marked the important date on the calendar. A date is also a sticky brown fruit with a long, thin pit inside. It grows on palm trees. Caroline uses dates in her baking. A date can also mean an appointment to meet someone, especially a girlfriend or a boyfriend. 
Tom asked Susan to go on a date Saturday night. Date. Say it one more time. Date. Correct. Daughter. 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 You say it. Daughter. Yes, again. Daughter. Mm -hmm. One more time. Daughter. That's right. A daughter is someone's female child. Mark has one son and one daughter. Say it again. Daughter. That's right. Dawn. 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 You try it. Dawn. Again. Dawn. Yes, that's right. Dawn has several meanings. Dawn is the very beginning of each day. I am happy when I see the first light of dawn. Dawn is also the start of something new. Steam engines marked the dawn of a new age. Dawn also means to begin to understand something. It will finally dawn on her that the teacher is very intelligent. Dawn. Say it one more time. Dawn. Yes. Good job. Day. 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 You try it. Day. Mm -hmm. Again. Day. That's right. Day has several meanings. A day is a 24-hour period from midnight to midnight. George was not allowed to eat for an entire day before his surgery. Say it with me. Day. That's right. Daylight. 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 You try it. Daylight. Again. Daylight. That's right. Daylight is the light of the sun during the daytime hours. Mark rushed to finish the hike while there was still daylight. We like to do our chores during the daylight. Say it again. Daylight. Correct. Dead. 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 You say it. Dead. Again. Dead. Yes, that's right. Dead has two meanings. Dead means no longer alive. Mary threw out the dead flowers. Dead also means to be without activity or excitement. This town is dead after 6 o'clock p.m. Nothing is going on. Dead. Say it again. Dead. Yes, that's right. We'll be right back after a short break with more Hello Word Power. Hey Dad, can you come out and shoot some hoops with me? Uh, sorry, I can't right now. Dad, studies show that by the time I'm 12, I can be influenced by friends more than parents. You know Billy, he's a pretty good kid most of the time. But do you really want him influencing me more than you? Billy. Spot your three points. Give your family everything. Give them your time from the Church of Jesus Christ of Latter-day Saints. Welcome back to Hello Word Power. Are you ready to learn more words in English? Let's begin. Deaf. 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 You try it. Deaf. Mm -hmm. Again. Deaf. Yes, that's right. Deaf has two meanings. Deaf means that someone cannot hear anything or can hear only a very little. The deaf man did not hear the noise. Deaf also means to choose not to hear something. Mother was deaf to my poor excuses. Say it again. Deaf. That's right. Deal. 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 You try it. Deal. Mm -hmm. Again. Deal. Yes, deal. Deal means to cover a subject or an area. Does that book deal 
with dog training. A deal is also an agreement. Yoko made a deal with her brother. Deal. Say it again. Deal. That's right. Deer. 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 You try it. Deer. Again. Deer. That's right. Deer means to be highly loved or highly valued. Christopher is Ryan's dear friend. My mother's necklace is a possession that is very dear to me. Dear. Say it again. Dear. That's right. Death. 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 You try it. Death. Again. Death. One more time. Death. That's right. Well done. Death means the end of life. Poison was the cause of her death. Death. Say it again. Yes. Well done. Debate. D-bate. Debate. You say it. Debate. Mm -hmm. Again. Debate. Well done. A debate is a discussion between two sides with different or opposing views. The political candidates held a debate before the election. I will debate the merits of that issue with my father. Debate. Debt. 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 You say it. Debt. Mm -hmm. Again, debt. That's right. You don't pronounce the B. It's silent. Debt. Debt is an amount of money or something else that you owe another person. Catherine will pay all of her debt once she begins her new job. Sometimes a debt has nothing to do with money. She owes her grandmother a debt of gratitude. Say it again, debt. That's right. Good job. We'll be right back after a short break with more Hello Word Power. Hello. The job market is a competitive place. In today's economy, extra skills mean a better job for you. Speaking English is the skill you need for greater opportunity, more money, and a brighter future. Introducing Hello Channel, an exciting new television channel that teaches English as you watch TV. There's something for everyone, and the more you watch, the faster you'll learn. All you have to do is say hello. Welcome back to Hello Word Power. Are you ready to learn more words in English? Let's begin. Decay. D -k -y. Decay. You try it. Decay. Mm -hmm. Again, decay. That's right. Decay has two meanings. Decay means to rot or to break down. Leaves decay to make rich soil. Decay also means to decline in quality. If you do not eat a balanced diet, your health will decay. His health has decayed over the years. Say it again. Decay. That's right. Decay. Deceit. 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 You try it. Yes, again, deceit. Mm -hmm. One more time. Deceit. That's right. Deceit is the act of lying or deceiving someone else. John's constant deceit made him untrustworthy. Deceit. December. 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 You say it. December. Again, December. That's right. December refers to the 12th month of the calendar year. 
Christmas and Hanukkah are both celebrated in December. Say it with me. December. Deception. 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 You say it. Deception. Yes, again. Deception. That's right. Deception. A deception is a trick that makes people believe something that is not true. The magician delighted the audience with his deception. Say it again. Deception. That's right. Decide. D. De side. Decide. You say it. Decide. Yes, again. Decide. That's right. Decide means to make up your mind about something. Stan and Rachel must decide whether to stay or go. Decide also means to settle something. They voted to decide where they wanted to have dinner. Decide. Declare. De-clare. Declare. You say it. Declare. Again, declare. That's right. Declare has two meanings. Declare means to say something firmly. Justin will declare he does not eat meat. He is a vegetarian. Declare also means to announce something. The government will soon declare that the war is over. Declare. Say it one more time. Declare. That's right. Decorate. 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 You say it. Decorate. Yes. Decorate has two meanings. Decorate means to add things to something else to make it prettier or more attractive. We are going to decorate the birthday cake with small candies. Decorate also means to give a medal or a badge or other recognition to a person. We will decorate her for her bravery during the war. Decorate. Say it again. Decorate. Yes, that's correct. Decoy. 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 You try it. Decoy. That's right. Decoy has two meanings. A decoy is a carved model of a bird that's used by hunters to attract real birds. The hunters placed their decoys on the duck pond. A decoy is also someone who lures a person into a trap or draws attention away from something else. The beautiful spy was a decoy. Say it again, decoy. That's right. You did very well today. Now, practice some of the new words you learned on Hello Word Power. Thank you for joining us. We'll see you next time.